Hello guys and welcome to a brand new video. Today I'm here with Violet Evergarden. Uh, what is this movie called? This is movie number one. Uh, Eternity and the Auto Memory Doll. Okay, um, obviously like I've seen the original anime of Violet Evergarden previously. Uh, so uh, that's why like there's no reaction to it. And I loved it. Just like, like everyone did. And it was amazing. And I still remember the 10th episode, it was called something like the mother's love. That was like the most uh, emotional episode in the whole anime. And in, I, can, I can say like in most of the animes that I've seen, like it was the most emotional episode ever that I've exper experienced. And it was so good. And uh, so yeah, like uh, I'll be doing the movie. This is movie number one. And later on, I'll do the movie number two. And... Um, so yeah and i'll be like uh i have to like get something off now that is uh something about the whole uh timer thing that is like uh, i know like a lot of people still don't understand the whole copyright thing so i'm explaining it to you guys and i'll probably do it uh, on every other movie that i react to uh, that is like uh like i'm unable to do anything no none of the youtubers can like put the whole uh clip or the whole uh, like including a sound and music everything you cannot do that that like if you do that your uh, co like content will be blocked in almost all of the countries and if your luck is like uh, bad then you might get a content ID strike you like uh, and then that will like if you get three or more strikes your channel will be like put down I had already gotten two strikes previously that's why I like went on a long break previously and like for like almost six months i did not want to do anything because one more strike i would have been gone my channel would have been gone so like i cannot do that that is the reason why i like put the timer reactions and all of without the sounds and all of these things like and uh, i i know like there are uh, uh, reactors who do the whole editing thing unfortunately they have uh, not, like fortunately they have editors and even if like someone uh, d like themselves do it it takes a huge amount of time to edit the whole thing i've tried it before no luck still my uh, like uh, uh, videos get claimed content id uh, claimed and i don't know how the others do it uh, i might be bad at it like editing so i have no like I, I can't do anything and if i like i put out uh, videos each and every day so it also takes a huge amount of time to edit so unfortunately this and each and every uh, video in my channel would be timer reaction unless and until like uh, I like get enough financial aid so that I can hire an editor like unless and until so for that I'm like my channel has to do co quite well which is unfortunately not the case now I'm hoping it will happen later on and I'm also like hoping someday I might get an editor, editor for myself so unless and until then i'm sorry but this will have to continue because like i can't do anything and uh, if you guys don't like timer reactions i'm apologizing so like if you like I, I i can't do anything so this and each and every videos in my uh channel will be like timer reacted and i'm like uh, saying this all of these things now because i've seen people dislike the video because of that so i'm explaining the reason uh, the reason why i can't do it so yeah anyways i just had to like put this thing out uh, uh okay for, so for the movie like as i said before i've like re watched uh, violet of a garden it was such a good show and i'm really looking forward to the finale that is like the mo second movie i think uh, i'll also react to that later on so for the time being let's uh do this one the movie number one i hope i won't cry like i really do not want to cry on camera so let's see um, okay, so without further ado, um, let's get started. All right, so as I said before, I'll be putting the timer and the subtitles here. Think it whichever is your preference, and let's get started with the movie. All right, so here's the countdown: three, two, one, go. Hmm. And the animation, like obviously Kyoani is like 
वन ऑफ द बेस्ट इट्स शेम दैट द होल आर्सन इंसिडेंट हैपन्ड एंड अ लॉट ऑफ लाइक पीपल लॉस द लाइफ Oh another thing i must mention i have seen violet evergarden quite a bit ago so i might not remember the names of everyone like i know, know violet's name but okay let's see wow there are like creases in the like paper itself like the amount of details I'm guessing this is a girl. She looks like one. Like she's wearing a boy's clothing, but I think she's a girl. Let's see. Like the anime itself is so damn amazing with the animation, and this is a movie with a higher budget. Just think of the things they can do. Okay. Sound is a bit loud. <clears throat> wow. I miss this uh, whole animation. Like, just look at it. Like, so damn beautiful. Who? Sibella Yoke. Okay. A woman's garden. Okay, so they're like royal, kind of like royalty. I'm guessing. High status. Oh. Violence. Sites. Eternity and the Outer Memory Doll. Okay. <coughs> Debut. I'm guessing into the like uh, society. Three months. Okay, so she's like a tutor for her. Yeah, she's a tutor. Oh. What? Oh, she has Okay, she must have hurt her hand. Like I'm talking about the girl. Yeah. Regular trains, regular travel.
yeah she f must feel like she's like in upset that she i'm in a prison but she's seeing people who can like go wherever they like doesn't feel like good about that i think okay wow the down is pretty nice yeah <laughs> three months wow <laughs> yeah oh my god wow all like ojo samas The way they talk as well. <laughs> there, the uniform is pretty dull looking, like. I thought it would be more flashy. Thank us. Thank us. Oh, so handmaidens have like us, like they sit behind it, all of them and like, what? Oh, these are like etiquettes? My god, that must be stressful, like. <laughs> Just look at her. <laughs> oh boy. Um, that's not how... <laughs> Watashi, yes. Oh, Watakushi, yeah. Wait a minute. What? Yeah, what, who is this girl? Like, we saw her in the ship as well. Wait a minute. She was that girl? Like the little girl? Oh, oh so was she like adopted or something? I'm guessing. Like, that's also one of the reasons why she like does not know all of these etiquettes like being in a high society and all. She feels like stressful and everything. Salon. Oh, okay.
<laughs> ladies yep oh my god she on seats are like feeling more um ah uh, stressful yeah Okay, so yeah. Wait a minute. He's called Taylor. Okay, calm down. Okay, I might be wrong. Uh, this uh, girl, uh, she was the uh, girl who was like, uh, like the elder girl who was like uh, cropping the hair of the little kid. Like I, I thought maybe it was the reverse. That's not it. She had small, shorter hair, so I did not recognize her. Hmm. Yeah, she's having her. Yes, she some kind of respiratory disease. Where's Violet? Like. Okay, there she is.
Yep, you're the soldier. <laughs> yep, daily duties. Oh. <laughs> the all of the people Yeah, now, like, without her glasses, I can, like, see the resemblance. Both of them are the... Wait a minute, so her whole hand is prosthetic, I did not know that. Did they show this before? I thought maybe her wrist or something. I can't remember, like season 1 was quite long ago. Oh, that was his sister. And gay. Okay, so I'm guessing she was adopted into that like um, family, like the high society. She's dreaming. Okay, she's learning, little by little, wow.
velvet <laughs> Oh, that's like a nice. <laughs> hmm. I like the previous one. No. Oh, she's okay. I thought maybe Violet will like um decline. Oh, well, that's the truth. Reality. Ah. Hmm. Yeah, she's drink oh, okay. Yeah, that is kind of true. Stars. <clears throat> mm. Oh. Wow, so many. Well, they are like people from the high society, so. Oh, same, different colors. Oh, <laughs> yeah, he was looking at the dresses. Hmm.
and she's feeling bad again because obviously like has to go and also like she has like a place to go <laughs> wow, like Okay Wait, this dress was sent by him? Yeah, like this is like a um what can i say like more of a kind of a butlerish type of uniform Hmm. I think this like the blonde girl feels like Wait, are they like holding the bouquet of flowers and dancing? Yeah, I do not notice that. Okay, that is dizzying. Hmm. And she'll have to go now. Like, uh, Oh, she's yeah. To I'm um, guessing, uh, yeah. Yep. Was adopted. I'm guessing. Wow, so beautiful. Uh, 
Okay, so she's like one of those dads. Okay. Oh, okay. So she was also adopted. Like not blood related, both of them. She is so tiny. How much old is she? Uh, five? <laughs> mm. <laughs> Revenge. Mm. Hmm. Well, his dad is uh, her dad is a lot better than I thought. Like I thought, maybe he he was like one of those uh, people, like asking to, uh, like buy booze or something. Ne ne. Oh, her teeth. What's with her teeth? No, her thickness, and here it is. But why did they like suddenly adopt her? What? Why?
Okay. Well, he's a friend, so friends don't no. Okay, I don't know. Is this girl? Okay, she's good. I kind of thought like she was like wanting to talk with her but like seeing Violet with her always she kind of hesitated. Wait a minute so just left in an I'm guessing an alternate?
Okay. What the? Wait, there is still a lot of time left, so what's going to happen after this? Oh, she's a lot older now. Because that was like the first scene we saw. Alright, okay. What's with this dress, like, at the back? <laughs> Scrap. <laughs> okay. Okay. Look and cross. Oh boy. Her teeth is like oh I'm I am i am guessing like it was like those baby teeth people like uh little kids have. Um. <laughs> uh. <clears throat> yep. Okay, she is has arrived to Violet's place. Yep. Will he recognize her? Yeah, I think he'll recognize. Like that distinct way of calling. Or did he not? <laughs> wow, damn, that's a long hair. She even can't, like. <laughs> Like her uh, talking is a bit strained because obviously she was not taught I think properly. She like uh, learnt it by uh, imitating others. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, he remembers now. Oh, okay, I was not expecting that. <laughs> yeah, now you have to like... <laughs> Oh. 
โอ้ก็ that's the truth well you should probably inform them well you can't do anything now <laughs> yep sister ฮึโอ้โอเค so yeah like obviously he she cannot speak properly yeah but she can probably like deliver things well I I think better it is better than like writing like <laughs> like you have to like learn a lot of things to like write letters Uh, like how will she uh Deliver them like she needs to have a vehicle, some kind of. Learn how to read. Yep. Mm. Oh. <laughs> okay. Well, this is more physically like um taxing. Well, obviously, like, yeah, he has been. <laughs> okay, one thing. Uh, I thought maybe she came here to like go to her sister, but she. Is like working with them. She must have some kind of uh, goal, like regarding her sister. Yeah, like does she want to like deliver letters to her sister? Something like that. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Uh, all right. Oh, so okay. Yeah, I kind of get like where she's coming from. 
Like she herself was like an orphan and when uh, uh, when uh, the letter came she felt happy. That kind of like struck with her. <laughs> hmm. Well, you can read, like, learn. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't remember? Time for your drill. <laughs> She can like braid her uh, hair extremely well. Like, uh, I don't know what, like, what it is actually with prosthetics. Like, I'm not even sure how that it works. Like, uh, do they like connect the nerves into the thing or something like that? Like, how can you uh, like move your fingers if it is like something that is not of your own flesh? Like, I'll have to, uh, I have to listen. Like, Check that out later on. I have already, always like wondered, but never checked it out. Like, how do like actual processes work? Yeah, she can like braid it so well. 
But braiding is a pretty difficult thing. Like at least if you don't have any like uh, experience. Uh, okay. <laughs> Our <laughs> clothes are a lot big. Uh. Oh, so she's teaching it like that. Okay, that's a pretty good way. Oh, oh, this a girl. I forgot her name. Lucy. Okay. Hmm. My friend is assistant. <laughs> what does what does that mean? <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah. Well, she found someone, I'm guessing. Hmm. So she is like delivering and learning at the same time. Okay. I thought maybe they were like going to uh like start reading or writing in like uh sitting down and all. But this is like kind of like a practical way. Okay. <coughs> I kind of forget like this place is like uh like an old era. Like all of this color and everything kind of uh make me forget. <laughs> yep. Okay, this is more like uh, what can I say? Like you manual ele elevator kind of. Okay. Okay. Um, you should probably exercise a bit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um. <laughs> oh. 
Oh, okay. Hmm, okay. Yeah. Yeah, like thinking about it, people might interpret it as as well. <laughs> mm, so bubbles. No, oh, she's remembering, uh, so time Oh Okay um oh, Okay She almost got insect I'm sorry I should not joke about that Wait, she doesn't remember? Like she, like even a thing like that, like she even asked a question like this before as well. Must be because like she was small or something. Like, like she was a, a lot younger. Yeah, that kind of inspired her. Yeah, and she can like take it.
Uh, no. Excuse me. Nah. <clears throat> oh. Oh. But she could have gone with him as well, like that would have been better, wouldn't it? No, oh, yeah, uh, Amy once like told uh, Violet about the stars. She's now. Yeah, okay. <laughs> okay, all right. Oh, she's also going. Okay, I was thinking, like, uh, won't she go with him?
So she, so she's now married. Evil. Yep, I think that's her. Yeah, that's her. Yeah, it's her like way of talking. They reverted back to her way of talking.
uh, can at least <laughs> I know like uh, coming out and meeting her will like make it a lot difficult so oh, she's not showing her face Oh, okay. <laughs> He's talking about Taylor. I'm guessing when she will be able to like properly deliver then will uh, then she'll like yeah then she'll like go and talk happiness mm. Oh. Okay. Hmm. Calling your name is all you like. Okay, that was good. Okay. Well, thankfully I was able to stop myself from <laughs> as always the soundtracks are amazing and the songs as well
this is the sa same person who uh, sang the uh, futari goto wasn't it yeah yeah uh, i think like uh, most of the songs are i i don't know the name of the person who's singing this but i, I love the, the song like futari goto uh, same thing like, from violet evergarden Okay, so uh, obviously this uh, movie was amazing, and the animation, the especially the artwork. <coughs> excuse me, mm, is as good as always, and uh, I'm. I think I'm not sure if uh, like uh, this movie uh, was made before or after the whole arson incident of Kyoani. Uh, I'm not sure about that. I, I can't remember uh, like when this is like pretty recently this came out this uh, movie So I'm not sure like Like hundred percent sure if this was like made before or after But like if this was like made after uh, the whole arson incident, I have to say like they um, Like pick themselves up again, and I think like obviously like another movie has come out uh, recently That is like the movie number two like it is just like uh, recently uh, aired and I'm sure that has also like the amazing animation that we see so I'm happy like uh, the whole arson incident with Kyo Annie was like uh, one of the uh, I don't know like most saddest and uh, like I don't even want to like think like the amount of loss of human life the loss of um like everything that was uh that happened at that so like i'm happy that they were able to stand back up like yoani is one of those animation studios that you were sure that they will provide and like i'm really happy that they did not stop and they're like going to continue like loss of KO any would have been um, like immense in like the animation um, industry and like I hope that they uh, they have obviously like come back and uh, like I really ho hope the best for them <clears throat> Okay, that was the end. Mm, yep, it's the end. Anything else? Oh, that's the end. Oh, uh, wait a minute. No, oh, the, that's yeah, that's the end. Okay. Um. Okay, so this was uh movie number one of Violet Evergarden. Uh and as always uh v like violet evergarden is a show which is a lot um slow paced karma and like and that is the main attraction the main beauty of this show and this was done perfectly here and they like paced the whole thing extremely well and it has had a nice um 
like slow pace and a nice like calming uh what can i say like nice calming pace and it was like well done obviously like definitely the animation the art style um the whole uh, uh beautiful soundtrack the osts each and everything the voice acting everything was top notch and uh, <clears throat> obviously like uh, violet evergarden is the most like one of the most emotional shows uh, it is like it takes you through a feel of emotions and um as i said before like uh, from uh, in the beginning of the uh, movie that uh one of the episodes that really like uh, that i loved so much was episode number i think 10 of uh, violet evergarden the anime it was uh, called uh, a mother's love and that was like the most emotional episode i've ever like like i don't remember anything more emotional than that one thing uh, that can like probably rival that uh, episode was uh, clanad like clanad's um uh, the whole uh, ushio and the if you guys have seen it like the nagisa's death ushio then like ushio's death and all of those things like that was i think that can probably rival that uh, there's also like anohana and uh, shigasawa kimino also uh, like lie in april and all of these they are definitely like emotional but i felt a lot more emotion like uh, like uh, emotion and emotional in uh this episode like uh, the episode number 10 of violet of a garden and clan at like clan was like that show for me like one of the saddest show and after that uh like if i would have to rank uh the episode like the shows like violet of a garden is a show itself which was sad but like episode number 10 like rivals everything but if i like have to like uh, rate the whole show in terms of sadness i would probably rate uh anohana Clanad and uh, uh, your lion, not your lion, April, uh, Anohan and Clanad. I would should probably like uh, rank those two above. Like it's like I'm talking talking about the sadness, about the sadness factor, a lot above than Violet Evergarden, the anime itself. But episode number ten would rival each and every one of them. Like episode number ten, I think it was episode number ten. Like uh, the mother's love, I think it was the name was uh, the episode where the uh, child there was a child and the mother was writing a letter for her uh, after her death like uh, like which would be uh, sent to her after each and every year in her birthday after the death and um like that was i think that that rivals each and every uh, like everything that i've seen but as an like the whole sadness factor i think clanet and anohana has it a lot more um than violet evergarden uh, but that episode like really blew me away like that was a, such a good episode um yeah as i was saying so like um like these like these are like a few animes that are so uh, like that can like capture the whole thing i think like the, another one is like currently uh airing uh that is um what was it called uh the day i become became god i think kamisama ni nattahi yeah uh, i think uh it's like the same from like june maida and uh, i think uh, he also said something about it like making it one of the most saddest uh, anime in the world i think um i don't know if anything can like rival clanet or like episode number 10 of violet ever garden but like i'll probably like binge it later on like after the whole thing is over uh, so i also have a lot of like expectations for that as well um anyways i'm talking of uh things unrelated to violet ever garden but yeah this uh movie this movie was as i said before a lot calm calmly paced obviously this was a movie that's the reason why uh and uh it was um it was quite quite amazing uh i loved everything and the whole um child uh, like uh not child but the sister uh becoming like being able to stand up on her own and then like uh, delivering the letters that uh, was once delivered to her and um, like uh, like this is such an uh, like amazing thing like just uh, look at it like uh, first of all uh, his uh, like her sister um, gave everything like gave away everything of her like her freedom each and everything her name all of those things just so that uh, her sister can like live properly 
and like she sacrificed a lot and after like she met violet and uh, like after talking with her and all uh, she decided to like write a letter to her sister uh, who was in an orf in, the, in the orphanage and um, she did that and that was sent to um, her sister taylor by uh, what was his name i forget the names benedict wasn't it the blonde haired guy um, by benedict and so after reading that letter obviously like her sister was like the most important person in her life in taylor's life after taylor read that letter she felt happy and she felt happy at the uh, whole uh, like prospect of getting the letter and that kind of made her admire the people who delivered them like that means like they're delivering happiness and uh but um no i, I was thinking about something completely different okay uh yeah uh, as i was saying like so they were delivering uh um happiness and that made her look for violet and coming there and deciding to become a delivery uh, person and after that violet read, read her like helped her to read helped her to write and she now like takes uh, like writes a letter even though violet helped her still like it is like her own words the things that she wanted to express uh, she like writes a letter and takes a letter help, like with the help of benedict and um gives it to amy and uh, like amy after getting that letter she understands and gets to know that yeah the things that she has done uh, done and like the sacrifice that she has made was not in vain uh, her sister is well and good and she is a lot more um uh, what can i say a lot more uh, happy to know that uh, violet is like taking care of her and helping her and it's like good to uh, know that um, like violet's uh, the people who took in violet also took in uh, took her in as well um amy and uh, uh, not amy uh, sorry uh, taylor taylor and she will have a, like a better life uh, from here onwards she'll become a delivery uh, girl and someday she would probably um deliver the letters that she wanted to deliver to amy herself and that will that will be the time when um amy's uh, like the efforts will be fully rewarded like she has only got partial uh, rewards by uh, getting the letter from her but after like when the day comes when uh, amy would uh, get the letter from taylor's hand herself and when she sees her that will be the time when she will be fully repaid for all of the sacrifice she has made it made and um like she will be happy knowing and seeing uh taylor to her own eyes and that is like the ultimate goal and we uh, like uh, barely got to know anything about uh taylor uh, amy's new family that is the count uh, that they were talking about whom she married uh, and i'm guessing most probably like in these things uh uh people who i'm not sure they, uh, like uh, in like most of the animals that i've seen like uh people who marry into royalty or like marry into like as a political marriage obviously like there are exceptions but most of the time they like the same thing happens like this like uh we see uh um amy here she being like always uh, stuck inside the house never coming out only for a brief period of time and um, just like uh, walking like that like uh, what can I say person who has like no freedom and uh, like, uh, like that is the like main thing like she was she sacrificed her freedom for uh, Taylor and uh, that is something like um, she did because obviously she loved Taylor and Taylor was the only person that was that she cared about in her whole life and for her well-being she gave everything she had and um even though she uh, is like living a lot better in terms of uh financial uh like prospects like she's a lot richer and everything uh the her main um happiness that was tailored uh yeah tailored 
and that was taken away from her so that really does not um help like she, all she wanted was to like live happily with her sister but she also knew herself that uh, they were not financially doing well and most probably if this continued uh, taylor that the things she said previously like when her dad came and uh, like asked why like uh, and she said that i'm going to take her in she said she, she said a word she said that uh, i will like this is like revenge i will uh, sh like uh, do not let her uh, live the same life that um person like like what did she say there i cannot uh, remember the actual words she said okay here it is uh, Just a sec. Um, I'm going to give her the choices I never had. Yes, that's that's the word. Uh, that's a perfect uh, way to like express. Like, yeah, I'm going to give her the choices that I never had. Like everyone, um, all of like even the par like even parents and uh, if like yeah, older siblings, everyone like thinks like that. That the person whom they are protecting or giving shelter to, uh, who are like under. Um, his or her guidance that's the first thing that they think like uh, they're like going to give him or her the choices that they never got so like that is like the main thing like that is the thing that she did try to give and uh, she knew that if she continued like that in that poor uh, like in living in that poor conditions she won't be able to do that she took her in she helped her from starvation but she could not like give her the opportunity to eat well like uh, she won't starve now but still she won't get good um, like opportunities or good food or good way to live uh, so like looking at the uh, uh, the chance that she has like when the people came uh, to take her in when the nobility uh, like the royalty people came uh, take her in she took that chance and um, just to give her sister the choices that she uh, deserved and every like every child should deserve and um, yeah and yeah and the only like um, what can I say reward or the only good thing that can happen after that was to see his like her sister doing well and most probably she'll get to see that uh, after her sister can uh, deliver the letters by herself then she'll like see her in front of her eyes and she will think that yeah my choice was not wrong i was able to provide something for a person the choices that i did never had i was able to provide that for someone else for my sister and that is like the ultimate happiness that you can have yeah and uh, yeah this was like uh, more of a two uh, like uh, like a movie which was broken up into two parts the first part was the whole uh, process uh, like the whole thing with um, amy, uh, amy and then after that is the whole part with uh, her sister taylor and yeah Violet uh, like helped both of them like uh, she helped Amy after she was alone and she felt lonely uh, she gave her uh, opportunity to what can I say like improve her um, condition like she was staying uh, as a kind of like a person who never had any interest in anything obviously like that is something extremely normal because she was uh, like accustomed to live a life one way but suddenly in the new environment she become became like uh, very like, conscious of herself like uh, she said stuff like uh, i won't be able to do it like what can i do like i'm not as good as the other people like inferiority complex because of the way she lived and she gave her the confidence she helped her like teach uh, taught her how to uh, like carry herself out properly and um, that kind of paved a way for her to like make another like a friend a real friend which was um uh, i think the lancaster yeah the blonde haired girl 
and uh, at the beginning I, I was a little bit uh, concerned about her like looking at um amy like that there was like two things that could have happened number one was like she was jealous of her uh, number two was she was like uh, she wanted to make friends with her but could not because obviously um amy herself did not want to make any friends and like violet was always with her so she kind of hesitated and i think like uh, the uh, lady like the lancaster lady she also kind of got overwhelmed by violet because people were like singing praises of her and she also kind of i think kind of found, found it like a bit uh like inferior to violet so she was not able to like go in front and um talk with uh, amy so after like uh, violet uh, helped her helped amy and uh, helped her to like uh, go accustomed to the whole place and uh, she, uh, like and then after she left um uh, the lady like a uh, lancaster lady she uh, be make, became like a friend with amy and that is, was also something that violet gave her she gave her an opportunity uh mm, like she helped her to make a friend and that is like uh, a very thing like uh, that was a thing like that was needed like she was all alone in the whole um place friend that she could talk with freely yeah that was something that she needed okay so yeah that was uh, this movie um definitely it's a beautiful movie and uh, yeah what else and i think obviously this is uh canon because like uh, the the evergarden family took her in so i am i can't really remember the anime like the anime it has been a quite a long time so i forgot all of the like details of it i'll probably like rewatch it later on uh, before the final movie comes out and um, yeah, so uh, I really cannot remember what actually was. I I really remember clearly the um, uh, episode number ten. That was like something that made a like permanent thing in my uh, like memories, and it won't go away. But the other episodes I really can't remember because it's been quite a long time. So I probably rewatch the uh, like anime itself later on after like before the final movie, like before I react to the final movie so yeah and uh, so yeah as i was saying i'm guessing this is canon because the evergarden family took her in and um, yeah she will like get a good future from here onwards even though i feel a little bad for amy because like the main problem that is like her freedom she won't get her freedom back i doubt like she will be able to break free of that place like uh, there will be like the whole thing of uh, being a person from the upper class uh, society and um, uh, Taylor uh, no but the Evergarden family took custody of Taylor so I don't know anyways um, uh, like yeah as I was saying like the whole freedom thing is going to be a problem and I st still feel a bit bad for her because she won't get her freedom back she will always be like the person um, trapped in a prison like she said before like she said in the uh, like beginning of the uh, movie like she said like this is like a prison for me and even though she was able to break free of it partially uh, I think like it still is like that and she is like she was just transferred from one prison to another and even though like her heart is all like free her heart is uh, calm and like happy after knowing that Taylor is okay still like uh, I really feel bad for her because she won't be able to like walk around freely um, go and play with her sister hang out with her sister laugh with her sister those are the things that she probably won't be able to do and that is like why I feel bad for her but Taylor would probably get a better future a better childhood that was like the main uh, intention of Amy. Wanted the best for her, and she got that. That makes her sacrifice worthwhile. <laughs> so yeah, this was uh, episode. Uh, uh, this was the movie uh, Violet Evergarden. 
and uh, movie number one as i said before this was amazing this was as always like beautiful and this provided the things that uh, we expected from violet evergarden and it is as good as always and i really enjoyed it it was uh that but yeah that's the beauty of the whole show so yeah the, so yeah guys uh, thank you for watching uh, if you guys enjoyed my reaction press the like button and subscribe if you're new to the channel or you haven't subscribed please be sure to do so comment down below anything you want to say about this uh, movie anything you want to share i'll be sure to check them out and um, so yeah guys uh, i'll be back with a new movie i'll think about what to do in the next week so and or if you guys have any kind of suggestions just comment down below any movies you want me to react to which i have not reacted i'll do them and um, so yeah i'll be back with a new movie next week and so until then goodbye and have a nice day